Another record that we can talk about too is E equals MC squared. It's got J-Rock of the Beat Junkies, the DJ, uh, in common on this. And this is from his 2006 album, The Shining. Dilla had a, quite a run in 2006, the year he passed away of, of releases. Um, but this record is real notable for his use of, uh, of the mini mode on the, on, on the bass line. And he really kind of takes this whole like G-Funk or really P-Funk aesthetic. And he uses, you know, instead of using, this is what I'm saying, when his style started to change, um, he went from filtering his bass lines to using a synth, you know, and that was like a major thing for him. And throughout, you know, specifically on this album, he uses the, the Moog a ton on his, on his bass line. Um, but it's important to note too, like he didn't play his bass line real tight, um, like he played it real, real loose. And he did that with a lot of his bass lines, was like they weren't like really snapped to the grid, really tight. They were real loose and real funky, you know. I mean, I think Questlove called this programming when he, when he did drum drums like a drunk baby. Um, so it's got two main samples. One is a classic, classic ultimate breaks and beats. You know, Bronx, um, B-Boy, B-B, um, uh, Manziel's Midnight Theme. And then you, you hear how he takes the, um, the vocal sample. And this is something that Dilla is incredibly known for, is taking the vocal sample from this uh, Giorgio Mordor uh, record and, he, and, and basically, you know, I mean, obviously, E equals MC squared. This is a pretty common MC record to find, but you gotta have doubles. Uh, uh, he's an Italian sort of like electro disco artist, has a bunch of cool shit, um, but works that sample and he tweaks it. And he tweaks, again, like what I'm saying with, with, with Dilla was he took these, these weird melodies and, and, he, and, and he was really known actually for taking um, vo vocal samples and manipulating the shit out of them to make them say something different. So if you listen to Tribe Called Quest's Get a Hold, um, he does some crazy shit with a vocal sample from like a psych group called The Circle. Um, he does this on um, a bunch of his records. He's really known, really known for that part. So, um, but Dilla the Chop Man, yo. Um, Dilla is just crazy with the chops and uh, I know my kitty's out here wiling out. Kitty! Hey, no! Kitty! Dude! Kitties, man. 